<laughs> now, our Rover reporter, Daniel Duty is on a French culinary experience this morning. That's right, dudes are celebrating the Bastille Festival in Sydney. Bonjour, mon ami. Comment ça va? Yes, ça va bien, Ange and Tristan. Mm. You are absolutely right. I'm celebrating Bastille Day. The Bastille <laughs> Day Festival is happening right here in the heart of Sydney City. Yes, it is a bit wet at the moment, but that's OK because a little birdie told me that it's going to clear up by midday and we're going to have loads of people storming in. And I'm here with my mate, Juzzy. How are you bonjour, going? Bonjour, mon ami. Uh, bonjour. Oh. Uh, Juzzy, what can people expect here at the Bastille Day Festival, which is happening over the next three days. Over the next three days, I'm here at the Tifal Chef Village and there's going to be so many other stores, lots of French food, of course, including snails, Ooh. crepes, and you can actually come down here at the Tifal Chef Village and you can make all of this. So lots of giveaways and lots of cooking, of course. Fun fact, Juzzy, did you know that French, the language, the French language was the official language in England for 300 years. You're kidding. No. Of course, it's the best. It's of the course. best. <laughs> all right, so we're going to be making snails. I've yes. never tried snails before. All right, so what, what's it all about? So, I mean, it's Bastille Day, so we really <laughs> wanted to do something extra, extra French. So I've got some butter in here, garlic and French shallots. And you want to do this in a food processor so it whips really well. Loads of parsley. And the, I'd say if you love garlic prawns, you're going to love this. <laughs> we whip this together and then we're going to stuff the snail shells. Oh, okay, so what are we stuffing the snail shells with? So these are the little snails right here, and I know a lot of people will be squirmish. In fact, the weather right now is perfect snail weather. <laughs> where, did, where, did you get these, where did you get these from? Not from your front garden. I promise they're not from the front garden, <laughs> but you can actually buy them like this at specialty stores if you want to have a go at them at home. And they actually come brined, and then you get the shells. All right, so oh, really can we actually, can we just see that over here? So yeah. the, everyday, uh, the everyday person can actually make and, and, and prepare snails at home? Absolutely, so easy. So they, they come in, they're already pre-cooked, they're clean, they're tidy, so all you need to do is pop them into their shell and then fill it with whatever you want. But classically, you'd serve it with this garlic butter, which is so good, and lots of baguettes, of course. And um, <laughs> I, I'm a little bit squirmish, but I'm sure they're going to taste OK. What, oh. what do they taste like? They taste like, I'd say, if you like mussels, you will like it, the texture and the taste. Well, because you fill it up with loads of this delicious butter like this and then you roast them in the oven or an air fryer. I'm doing it in my special T-Fowl air fryer here and it works a treat because have a look at these. OK, ones. we'll swap there. And Tristan, have you guys ever tried escargot snails before? May we, bien sûr. And Tristan, oh, no. Tristan has got a hankering for them. I've never oh. seen him salivating so much to try something new. Isn't oh. that right, Tristan? <laughs> yeah. they, oh, they look really good. Oh, Have no. a look at this, Angela. Tristan, they look so good. All right, so we're going to taste them right now. So is it good with a, a bit of ba uh, baguette? And You must have baguettes. Okay. So here you go. All right, here we go. Oh. Get this. It looks right. nice and bubbly. Do you want me to hold that yes, for you? Yes, okay. Thank hold you. It. All right, so which one, should, which one should I take? I reckon that's a really nice juicy one okay, right so there. What do I do? And you literally oh, pick the meat out. Oh, it's very hot. It's hot. It's hot. Maybe do you I'll... want me to do it for you? Yeah, yeah get that one. Get that one. Yeah. Ah, that's ah, hot. Ah, that's hot. <laughs> that's hot. Get in there. Oh, it's hot. It's hot. It's hot. Oh. Oh, 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 don't burn yourself. You got it. A little bit of... Oh, okay, here we go. Oh. Okay. Like chicken? Yeah, like chicken, <laughs> chicken or beef. <laughs> it's okay. very French. Oh, all right. Well, I'll continue eating this. And uh, Juzzy, thank you so much. Thank you. Au revoir. Au revoir. Uh, Judy, please, oh, um, bizu, bizu. <laughs> please bring Go some back one. for Tristan to try, Enjoy okay? It. Savor it. Nick. Oh, all right. I'll, yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'll bring some back for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Maybe no. it's good with some baguette. Baguette. Here's your baguette. Oh. Good man, <laughs> Judy. Check it out. Oh. Bon appétit. No. Now, there's still plenty to come.